Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Rishi Labs. In today's video, we will see how to download and install VMware Workstation on Windows. So let's get started. You require a web browser. I'll make use of Google Chrome. In the search bar, you need to enter VMware download. So you will get this first link selected. That is VMware.com. If you get cookies pop up, select required only. Now you need to click on this download now button. Now this will take you to the Broadcom website. To download the software, you will need to create your account on a Broadcom and sign in. Then you will be able to download the software. So let's quickly do it. Now on this page, you need to click on this click here. Okay, select required only. Now we'll first register. Just enter your email address and capture and click on next. This will send a verification code to your email address. So we'll copy this verification code and paste it here. Then click on verify and continue. Now I'll fill this form. Click on I accept create account. So registration is done successfully. Then you can click on I'll do this later. Now you can go back to our sign in page. Over here, you need to enter your email address. Click on remember me. Click on next. It is going to ask you for your password. Then click on sign in. Click on close. So once you are logged in, you need to click on my downloads. Okay, over here you need to select free software downloads available. Click here. Over here you will get the list of all VMware products which are free to download. Since we are downloading VMware Workstation for Windows, so we are going to access this link VMware Workstation Pro. If you are downloading it for the Mac, you can go for VMware Fusion. Okay. So we'll click on VMware Workstation Pro, select it. There are two options available for Windows and Linux operating system. We are going to click this Windows link. Then we'll select the latest one. To download this software, you need to click here, Terms and Conditions. Go back and then click on I agree. Okay, so now it will get checked. Now here is the link to download the software. Select this. Click on yes. So here is another form which you need to fill in to download the software. Then click on I agree and submit. So once your account verification is done, it is going to allow you to download. So now you can see HTTPS download option is available. Once you click on this download button, it is going to download the software. It will take some time to download this. Once the software is downloaded, you need to click on open. I will minimize the web browser as we don't need it. So this will start the setup of VMware Workstation Pro and click on next. I accept the license agreement, then click on next. Install Windows hypervisor, select it, then click on next. Add VMware Workstation console to system path. Click on check this and click on next. 
then click on next click on next install so vmware workstation setup has completed and click on finish this is the desktop icon of vmware workstation pro let's double click and start it this is how the interface of vmware workstation looks okay you can create your new virtual machine open existing virtual machine you can also connect to a remote server we'll look at these features in the next video that's how the interface of the vmware workstation pro looks that's all for today guys do subscribe to my youtube channel rishi labs thanks for watching